Hey guys, it's JD from Ponzo World, and today we're unboxing and reviewing the sun lamp made by Am's Cool. Now this is a $29 mood lamp that you can find on Amazon. Links will be in the description below if you want to go pick this thing up. And I um, guess there's not really much more to say about it other than the fact that this thing has two reviews on Amazon, and I know one is five stars, and I believe the other one is two. So this thing uh, seems to be pretty good for the price. So I'm gonna go and start off with uh, showing you around the box here. You can see here on the front, uh, first of all, we have a label right there, 10,000 uh, LUX, so I don't know what that is exactly, but a UV-free LED therapy lamp. Uh, so there's that. So it is UV free. That's very important because the uh, sun itself gives out UV rays and that isn't good for your eyes. So it's very important that you get a UV free one so then you don't ruin your eyes over time and uh, possibly even other things in the room because UV can do some uh, pretty good damage to you and multiple other things. So anyways, you can see here once again, Am School, light up your life. On the side here, we have another label. Uh, there's that one. I don't really think that one does anything, but there it is. Am's cool uh, right there, and that's on all of the sides, yep. And then on the bottom, we have nothing. So let's go and open this thing up. Um, it looks like, yeah, you just pull here. And all right, so it looks like, first of all, we have a, a user guide, user manual, whatever you want to call it, right there. It's in English and okay, it's on English on the other side too. So there's that. Let's go and fold it up, set it off to the side. And we also in here have, I believe this is going to be the power. Yeah, it is. Okay, so the power brick right here. It has a little light on it. Okay, that's quite nice. And let's go and see what kind of power this puts out. It is 24 volt, uh, 0 0.5 amps. So there's that. And here's the end in case you're wondering. Let's go and set that off to the side, and we also have, I believe the last thing is just simply a sun lamp, and yep, that is it. Or actually, this is a, okay, so this is just an on and off switch, and maybe like, for a, maybe like a dimmer too. Okay, so there's that. There's the back of it. Let's focus on that. And then, last thing is the uh, sun lamp here, and feels... Feels honestly really good. Has a texture on the front. And uh, this is made of metal. Is the entire shell? I believe the entire shell is made out of metal. That's quite impressive. So there's that, at least the bases. The whole shell feels like metal, but might be wrong about that. Anyway, so here's this. So, so far so good. So what I'm gonna go and do now is uh, plug this thing up and I'm also gonna turn off the lights and go in and show you guys uh, how bright this thing is. All right, so here I have the uh, sun lamp plugged up. You can see right here, I also have the uh, dimmer plugged in. Um, I believe you could just go from the power source directly into this thing right here and just bypass the uh, dimmer altogether, but I'm not gonna risk it. I don't wanna screw anything up. Um, so I'm just not gonna even try it out. But anyway, so there's that. Um, now I am going to go ahead and turn off this light above you guys. That's the only light on right now other than the... Uh, sun lamp here so i'm gonna go and turn that off right now and there you go so now the uh, sun lamp is the only thing lit up in this room other than the uh, kindle over there but let's go and focus on it there we go and now this is pretty low i believe yeah it was pretty low light um now i want to point out something near the end this little dimmer right here this thing gets really, uh, I guess, like specific, picky, whatever you want to call it. Um, like, the closer you go to the bottom, you really have to, like, control this thing. You really have to turn it very, very slightly for it to go on, like, the lowest setting, such as this right here. So you have to be really specific about that. Um, but once you start getting up into, like, the uh, the brighter light i guess you would say uh, it starts getting better so you can see here i'm slowly turning it up and this thing i have to say it does truly get really bright and there it is and that right there is all the way up extremely bright 
I'm gonna, I, there's really not a good way I could show you guys this, but it's lighting up pretty much a good portion of this entire room. This thing is extremely bright, so very impressive. And um, obviously that wouldn't be good if you're like studying or something, something that this thing is for. Um, you don't want it on the brightest setting probably all the time. Um, so I really like that you can control that here. That's really, really helpful. There you go. So definitely very bright if you want it to be. And obviously you could also bring it down if you want. But uh, definitely a very bright sun lamp. So very impressive. Um, gosh, that is really bright. So that's pretty cool. So this thing will definitely, I guess, get you in a better mood. Because um, like in dark, like dark rooms, it kind of really sits like a bad tone bad mood this thing can light things up and make it way better so uh there's that so quite cool so what i'm gonna go and do now is go and stop this clip and i guess go and give you guys my final opinions all right so overall what do i think of the sun lamp i honestly think that this thing is kind of cool for the price now for me I wouldn't personally buy something like this, like a mood lamp or something like that, because I just don't have much of a use for it. Uh, but some people like these type of things, and honestly, I kind of like it too. Um, personally, I still wouldn't buy it. There's not much like of a use for me, but some people have more of a use for something like this than me. And for that, I definitely recommend this thing here. It seems very bright and pretty darn well made for the price. Once again, definitely at least the base itself. At least this part right here is made of metal. It honestly feels like the entire thing is. And if it's not made of metal, it's made of some sort of a really nice material. Um, overall, once again, this thing just seems really solid. It's definitely very, very bright. And once again, if you don't want it that bright, you can turn it down here using the uh, knob right here. You can see right there. You can also turn it completely off. You see there, I'm going to start turning it up. And that is, once again, as bright as it gets. Very, very bright. I'm truly impressed by that. I'm very surprised. Uh, so there's that. So definitely, if you're in the uh, market for like a good mood lamp, I do definitely recommend this thing. Maybe this thing will even be good for a, a Christmas present in the next few days. So uh, overall, once again, if you're looking for a good mood lamp on Amazon, I do really recommend this thing. It seems very nice for the price. So uh, yeah, I guess that's really it for this video. Hope everybody enjoyed, and don't forget to like and subscribe. I'll see y'all next time. Goodbye.